in this video i'm going to be making the Igbo stew to make Igbo stew it's quite straightforward and um, very close and similar to the um ewa going but it's just a bit of freshness in the Igbo stew that we're going to be using um but that's what the difference is, is more of dried for the ewa going but for Igbo stew you will want to use um some freshness and some dryness to get you that texture and the taste that you really want so what we're going to be using in this video i'm going to be using some scotch bonnet for my egg bo egg bo stew and i also got my my pepper here which is also fresh so i'm going to be using some fresh pepper i've got some dry shombo it's called shombo which is the dried um dried of this one which is you know dried pepper which i'm going to be soaking um cleaning very very properly i'm going to be using some crayfish i've got some cameroon pepper here which is this we're going to be using some cameroon pepper of course you've got my salt i've got my seasoning there you feel free to use any seasoning you want to use and of course onions i'm going to refine two onions and i'm going to be blending one onion with this you don't have to blend it smooth to make sure it's just coarse so it gives you that texture and that flavor or um, it is not smooth okay we're just gonna blend it I had in my um, my shombo I'm gonna add my shombo and I'm gonna add my crayfish I'm gonna add my Cameroon pepper Add my scotch bonnet. I'm gonna add the pepper as well. I'm gonna add my onions. Add a bit of water. in your hot oil um, then we just pour our onions fry the onions for like 10 minutes and then we then add our blended um, ingredients so here we have um, the blended um, the blended Cameroon pepper, scotch bonnet, bell pepper, onions and also we have the shombo here so I'm just gonna pour that into the pepper now a little bit of water I'm just gonna give it a good stir Wow, let's have a look One tablespoon of uh, seasoning and one teaspoon of salt I'm just going to let this cook for 15 minutes, then we take it out from there. Right, um, the sauce has been cooking for 15 minutes now, so I'm just going to stir. And um, yeah, absolutely ready as you can see. Looking nice, looking good. And um, yeah, that's what I'm going to be using to eat the Ebo. You can use this to eat rice, you can use it to eat yam, you can use it to eat a wagoni. Um, but I am going to be using this to eat a book. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my other videos.